Hello everyone. So in today's video, uh, we'll be discussing how we can deploy the Vania sample data to a Magento store. So without any further ado, let's get started. So uh, last time, uh, if you guys remember, I shared some steps where uh, you can install Magento in an uh, Ubuntu subsystem if you're running it in your uh, Windows machine. So previously I had shared all these steps in detail and I've shared the same in my GitHub link. I believe you guys must have followed it. So after installing it, if you remember, uh, this is how the Magento store was looking. This Luma page was there, it was completely blank without any data. So today, uh, what I have decided, so in case you need any data, so let's say here if you can see there are so many cat uh, categories and various number of data are coming up in your websites currently. Now the reason being is that this is the Vania sample data which can be installed in Magento's uh, store whenever you are installing it. So today I'll be discussing those steps with you. So it's very much important if you're doing any custom development so that you have the data all in your website, be it various types of products, simple, configurable uh, and bundle so that you have all the data and the look and feel you should get before developing anything. So if I go to here and if I scroll down, so yeah, so like it's not very complicated. You just have to spend some time running because these commands will take some time to execute. So you just have to wait for those things. First of all, since you have uh, you are using the composer, yeah, see here if it's written Venia sample data. So this is the Venia sample data as I told you. So you have to run this command composer config. Once that is done, you have to install the Venia sample data. That is a Magento slash Venia sample data. Uh, the second step. Once that is done, just run the upgrade command, the reindex, and this is very much important. That is the catalog images resize. This is not only for this Venia sample data, but it can also helpful if you have so many uh, like huge number of catalogs having different types of product images and all. Uh, so this is the command where it will help you to resize those images. And because there are various say, various instances where you find errors and all, so this might help you. Uh, this is the catalog images sizes resize. And uh, the last uh, last two steps are the static content deploy because it's it's a sample data, and the last one is the uh, the permissions for various uh, folders. I'll just remove the last point. Yeah. So in total, there are seven steps which you have to follow. So once these steps are completed, you can refresh the Magento's website. And once uh, you refresh it, you can see this whole new home page. Uh, like there's various banners and all uh, here, and the top sellers kind of configurations uh, product listing will be there. So all such things can be configured, can be changed, can be changed and whatever data you need here from the Venia sample data, you can do that. So it's very much useful if you need some sort of data, let's say customers, the products and all uh, for your development part. So I hope you, if you guys can follow here, like whatever steps, it's very much simple. As I said, if you still get any error, please drop in your uh, query in the comment section. I'll definitely try to reach out to you and give you the solution. Because when I executed, these are very simple steps. I did not get any error. So I hope you guys also will not get any such a error. So you just have to wait for that, for the execution of these commands. So I think with that, I can uh, close this uh, video and I'll see you next time. Thank you guys.